Hello coin collectors out there, fans of the International Coins and Paper channel. On this channel we're sharing some of my international coins that I think you might like and enjoy seeing if you're into coin collecting. So here are five of some of my favorite uh, 20 euro cent coins. We've got one from France, Austria, Belgium, Netherlands, and Ireland. So I'll move these ones out of the way so we can focus in on this one. Just based on the lighting with making these videos, it's easier to look at them one at a time. So let's start with this one right here. This one happens to be dated 2009 and comes to you from the country of France. So this is what's, uh, uh, let's start off with this side actually. Uh, this side is what's called the new map. So the old map for the Eurocent coins looks something like this. This map was used up until 2006. Then they switched over to this map right here. This map started in 2007 and has been going all the way until today. So now that we got that out of the way, let's look at the uh, country specific side, which is this side right here. As you can see, uh, this design in the center, you might have seen that image before on other coins from France. That is the Sawyer. It was originally designed by Oscar Roti, an artist. Uh, it represents France while staying true to itself whilst integrating into Europe. So the Sawyer is this lady right here. She's uh, walking very confidently into uh, Europe while staying true to herself. This one's dated 2009. That's why it has the second uh, map on the other side of the coin. Other features on this coin, we see RF, abbreviating for uh, Republic of France. And then right here, this is the engraver's name. And then we see Oscar Roti, who designed this image right here. Now let's uh, move right along up until the uh, next one. This one right here comes to you from the country of Netherlands. Now this coin, uh, in the center, we have a uh, uncluttered kind of group of stars. And then in the very middle is Queen Beatrix. She's encircled by an uncluttered portrait. I'm not sure why they decided to make this portrait of her uncluttered. Uh, but all the different coins, they all have different designs. Some of them have artwork, some of them have buildings, some of them have people. This one right here, we've got Queen Beatrix representing uh, Netherlands. Now the uh, writing on the outside of this coin translates to Beatrix, Queen of Netherlands. So uh, kind of reasonable that that would be the saying going around the outside of the coin. The third coin in the series of five that I'm sharing with you today is this one right here. This one comes to you from Ireland. When we flip it over, we see Erie. Uh, that translates to Ireland in Irish. Uh, we have a Celtic harp in the center, and then 2004, uh, the year that it was produced, on the other side. Now, going around the outside of all of these coins, we have the 12 stars of Europe. So that's a pretty common imagery that you'll see going around the outside right there. Fourth of the five is this one from Austria. Now this one has some of the more um, detailed design on it that you'll see in all of the Eurocent coins because it's got this very cool building right here. That's the Bella Verde Palace. It's one of the most beautiful Borek palaces in Austria. It's where uh, the treaty to reestablish re the Austrian sovereignty was signed in 1955, uh, making its name synonymous with freedom. It's encircled by the face value uh, which we see right here, uh, euro cent, so it's just worth uh, 20 euro cent. There's a 20, and then euro cent right there. Then the 12 stars of Europe going around the all the outside. And finally, in this series of five, we have this one uh, coming to you from Belgium. Dead in the center, we have a portrait of Albert II. This is one of the more boring designs of the euro cent coin. It's just got a portrait of this guy right here. No artwork, no buildings, um, just this guy. Uh, nothing, nothing really too descriptive of his characteristics either. Um, it's just a guy with some hair and, an, and some glasses. He's facing the left. All right, hopefully you enjoyed this video. We'll recap. We looked at the Ireland, uh, Austria, France and Netherlands coins. If you're into coin collecting, please do check out some of these other videos on the channel. Thank you very much and take care. Best of luck coin collecting out there, everyone. Enjoy.